What's up guys, welcome back to another weekly vlog. So I'm gonna try to do this quick. It's Monday, back to the normal vlogs. And if you guys don't know, I went on vacation. I went to uh, Florida this past week and I miss uh, one week of school. Funny thing is, the week that I was gone, right, both my classes had exams. So, I am going to school right now, even though I don't go to class on Mondays. I'm going to school to take my makeup exam. <sighs> Let's do it. You know what the funny thing is? While I was away uh, in Florida last week, I didn't study at all. So I don't really know <laughs> how well I'm going to do. I'm going to probably like guesstimate and uh, wing it and hope for the best. Alright, so I just went in to take my makeup exam. I actually had two, but when I went in there, they said only one of my professors put my exam there. So I only got to take one and it was a quiz. The questions were very simple, yet I did not know them because I did not look at the book. So that sucks. I think I did okay, but not the greatest. My hard exam was the exam that was not there, so I emailed my professor and hopefully I get to make it up tomorrow or something. Now I'm gonna go to GameStop because I need to pick up a new controller. Both my Xbox One controllers are jank. So I just picked up this brand new Xbox One controller. I was thinking about getting the Xbox One controller like Elite, the one that you can like switch out everything, but it's like 150 bucks and I don't know if I want to spend that much for a controller. Seeing that I go through controllers like a pack of gum, like I, when I play fighting games with the controller, they don't last that long. So I just got the default one and uh, see how this goes. And if it doesn't work, if there's one little problem with this controller, I'm returning it right away because I do not want this controller to be like my last controller. The little D-pad thing screwed me up. Okay, so I just updated my new Xbox One controller. I'm in Mortal Kombat. I'm on the character select screen. I'm gonna test out if everything is good, okay? So, let's see. We're gonna go over. Okay. Yeah. Down. Over. 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 Up. Okay. So far, everything's good. Now, let's pick a character, and uh, I'm gonna play like this so you guys can see the controller, and also so I can see when I edit the video if everything is uh, still okay. So, I'm gonna pick Johnny. Because that's the character that I mainly need to have the proper inputs. Alright, so we are in it. Okay, I'm going to move backwards, forwards, backwards, dash. Okay, so far everything's good. Now let's see if I can do the combo. If I can do a combo, that means the control is fine. Okay, so far so good. I meant to drop that. Feeling pretty good. I don't see any problems so far. I have occasional drops, but that's just because I need to get used to controller. Oh, Johnny! Oh, Johnny, police! So this one is good to go. I'm happy with it. This thing will probably last me uh, a month, and then um, it'll probably break. And it's funny, because I don't really trash my controllers. I take care of them pretty well. But whatever. I am currently in a bathroom. Not my bathroom, actually. I'm in Ikea. What did you find out? Some nice pants, man. Because I'm in Ikea right now, I'm helping my friend out, buying some furniture. I'm just going to answer your question right now, doing Q&A. First question, what are you looking forward to for Killer Instinct Season 3? Probably Arbiter and Arash. You're looking for Arbiter, right? Oh my god. Oh, yeah. Dude, Arbiter dude, how is that even possible? I've seen that, that trailer. That, yeah, oh my god, that's so sick. So Arbiter, I'm looking for, uh, forward to. Ikea has it all. 
Will you be streaming Compact 2 on launch day? Uh, probably not because that'll be midnight and I have class that next morning. So if anything... Yeah. Very bad. Oh hey, what's going on? <laughs> Nothing. Uh, so I will be streaming it probably the next day after... But not on midnight. This is my new setup here. Look at that, pretty cozy. I got uh, demoted. Next question is... What is your favorite thing about 2016 so far? My favorite thing is probably going to Florida so far, but PAX is coming up, so when that happens. That's probably gonna be my favorite thing. Next thing down from that is probably Ikea. Ikea's the best. Do you do anything outside of making YouTube videos, like hobbies or something? Uh, I live stream and I like watching movies. Oh, okay. 2,000 years later. We finally got one. Matt, Matt, you're such a child, Matt. Keep going. Get your stuff. We're good to go. All right, so we just finished IKEA, and now this is like an hour away from where we live. So we're just looking around the area and we saw a bunch of jank stores and then there's this one place called like, I don't know if you guys can see it, Destiny, Destiny Games. Destiny Games. So we're going to check that out. Let's go. They have games, board games. That's cool. Original PlayStation games? Wow. Oh my god, dude. Perfect game for you. <laughs> that? That's that's your game, man. For the channel. I'm gonna do this for the channel. Alright, sorry. Right. Yeah, this place is pretty cool. Yeah, he doesn't, he's not just like, oh, I just bring sprout wings to fly away, but he's like. Alright, so there wasn't really anything in there uh, that interesting. There was a lot of retro stuff, n new stuff, card board games, everything you can think of. But there was not like a lot of that, it was just little bits of everything. What do you think of that, Sir Matt? Eh, two out of 10. Two out of 10. I don't think it was that bad, but I, I wouldn't give it like anything above a six. It was like a five. Five out of 10. The outside was more hype, and now it's really bright. And the last question goes to the real mortal, and this says, what was your parents' thoughts of you doing YouTube? At the beginning, my mom supported me a little bit. Uh, she still said, you know, focus in school and do YouTube when you have free time. My dad, on the other hand, he did not support it at all. He said, um, he really thought it was just like a waste of time. He said I should go find a real job and make money and stop wasting your time doing YouTube. And I did do that, I did get a job, but I still did YouTube, you know, at the same time. So I went to work, and when I went home, I did videos. And then finally, when my videos or YouTube made more money than my actual job, then I said, see you later, and then my dad's like, oh, okay, you know what, now I support you. Which is fine, uh, I'm glad that they support me now, which is uh, a very, very good thing, because if I have support for my family, it makes doing YouTube a lot more um, enjoyable for me. And the last thing before I end off this vlog, I already know it's late. I actually went to the movies with my friend uh, after we went Ikea shopping. Uh, we went to see Deadpool again. Well, I went to see it a second time. That was his first time seeing it. And I still enjoyed the movie the second time. But right now it's 11.38 p.m. So I'm probably not going to have this vlog out this Sunday. I'm probably going to have it out Monday, which I did pretty good. I did eight weekly vlogs in a row of the year 2016. I didn't miss a Sunday, and I finally missed a Sunday. It sucks, but you know what? I'm still going to try to upload every Sunday. I know I missed this one, but let's try not to make it a regular thing to miss the vlogs. But, I haven't showed fan art from you guys in a while, so let's get it going right now. This one is from uh, Knight of the Fet. He drew this cool Batman, Red Hood, Robin fan art right here. Batman is holding a freaking lightsaber. Yo. You know Batman's gonna win against Superman if he has that. This next one is from Demont Williams. If I mispronounce your name or anyone's name, I apologize. I suck at pronouncing names. He drew me, uh, ripping off Noob Saibot's head. There's Shao Kahn on the bottom, severed. Shang Tsung is dead. Pretty cool, man. In real life, if I fought them, I'd probably lose, but I'm glad that I won this battle. This next one is from Dead Raka. He drew me and Barack, and it says, Nice hoodie, or uh, I'm trying to read it backwards. Something like nice hoodie, it says, 
I know, right? Subscribe to Uncaged Games. That is awesome, dude. Really cool. I love the red that you did on the hoodie. Really do appreciate it. Thank you for the fan art. This next one is from your boy Johnny Cage. And it's a picture of Johnny Cage. Has Uncaged on the top right there and it says hashtag yo. That is awesome, man. You guys are really artistic. I can't draw this for crap. This next one is from the boy, DS Kristoff. Another fan art. Here we go. I like this one. It's very simple but yet very cool. Me rocking the red hoodie, the signature look, and I have a pretty deep v-neck. Is that a tattoo? Do I have a tattoo? Pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. Thank you so much. This next one is from Shane Campbell. We got the homie Scorpion. And it says Uncaged Games right there. Really nice. I like the colors, man. I like how you guys color in the pictures. You guys don't have to color in, but I do like color. And uh, this one's popping with that yellow. Now we're moving over to Instagram. This one's from Nemesis. I'm not rocking my red hoodie, but I'm rocking a red, like, scarf bandana over my mouth. And it says Uncaged Games. It says I ain't no noob. And it says Rip Johnny WW2K16. It sucks that he's gone, but it's alright because we had a good time and this is awesome fan art. Thank you, Nemesis. This one's from Anthony. He drew, it looks like me and Batman knuckle touching it up. Do I have swords on the back of me? Yo, I am packing some weapons. I think this person already sent a fan art in, but you know what? The more the merrier. We got another one from best YouTuber on the planet. It has me with a lightsaber cutting off Noob Saibot's head and it says, you just got caged noob with a lightsaber. Yo, uh, noob is not coming back anytime soon. And that was all the fan art uh, from last week and the week before that. Thank you to everyone that drew me fan art. I really do appreciate it. If any of you guys want to draw me fan art and want to be featured in the vlog, send it to me on Twitter, at my Twitter, at Uncaged Games, or Instagram, at Uncaged Games with two Zs, and do not send it to me through DMs. I do not check my direct messages, all right? Tag me in the picture. That's all you guys got to do, and I'll feature it in uh, the next week's vlog. Also, make sure, if you guys do me a fan art, Try to put my name somewhere on it so I know that you guys are drawing it for me and not for someone else. Because if you guys draw a normal picture of like, I don't know, Super Mario, you guys can be giving that to anyone. But if it has my name on it, then I know you guys are actually drawing me fan art. So, just a little thing. Anyways, thank you to everyone that sent me fan art. But that's going to wrap up this week's weekly vlog. If you guys enjoyed, give the video a like. There's a small amount of you guys that like the vlog, which I really do appreciate. It's not really that small. It's actually a pretty good size amount of you guys that are watching the vlog. So, for all you guys, thank you so much. I love you guys long times. Thank you for liking. Thank you for commenting. And I know I've been slacking on replying to comments. I apologize. I've been trying to get my uh, school situated and uh, everything back to normal. But I will get back to replying as soon as I can. Thank you guys for watching the vlog. Like, and I'll see you guys next Sunday. Who are you defending, Jay? I'm match? actually gonna go for Captain America just because I know for a fact that Captain America would look for the past. Captain America. Well, who do you think it is? Okay,